curtains for London's Old Vic Theatre. Hi, Neil Sean here in the heart of London. Thank you for joining me today. That is one of the stories breaking out of London today. Now, let me explain. This has all kicked off simply because something regarding um, the Monty Python star, Terry Gillum, right? Now, we know he's a funny man. He's written many funny things. But in this woke world, apparently, somebody's been offended by the fact that he's going to be co-directing, producing, or was, the Sondheim classic Into the Woods. This was about to premiere at London's Old Vic Theatre. Anyway, I won't bore you with all the minor details, but now, apparently, because he said something years ago, they've decided to pull the production. Well, this has backfired as it always does with things like the Old Vic. Now, I don't know if you've ever been to the Old Vic in London, but, you know, I've seen livelier corpses sitting in audience seats. The productions that they do are very worthy, and most of them, of course, are funded by the Arts Council of England, simply because they're always asking for money. But guess what? They turned down thousands of pounds by letting this production walk out the door. As I say, this is all to do with basically a statement that Terry said quite a few years ago now. Now, here's the problem. If you're running a theatre, you need people to come in. Theatre's all about creating new works, old works, disturbing the peace, getting people to talk about your product. But it appears in this woke 21st century society, you're not allowed to do that. And Terry, I love this term, has found himself cancelled. But really, who's cancelled who? If you think about this, the old Vic, right, have now put out of work bar staff, ticket collectors, doormen, backstage staff, stage door people, all because they don't want to be seen as doing the wrong thing. Now, this production could easily get picked up by another theatre. I do hope it does, and I'm sure it will go on to be a huge success. I'm for live and let live, as you know. Do exactly what you please, but stop trying to impose your views on other people at the cost of others losing their job. As for the old Vic, well, if it closes and turns itself into flats, then no doubt the people that have managed to close this production will finally be woke happy. Neil Sean in the heart of London.